Hello, welcome back. Last time, Fire Temple happened and took as long as it was going to take. I have a lot of hearts. I've collected quite a few of those. Uh, and it's not done, but I do have a certain legendary hammer that I can do lots of things with. So I'm back at the entrance where there's this stuff. Maybe that'll get me around to where that one imprisoned Goron and boss key is. I can't move while those are in the process of disappearing. I do have a key for you. There might not be much dungeon left, but every time I wonder how much is left, it's always more than I expect. Alright, Bat. Your being alive is not acceptable, neither is yours. What was this about having to swing my sword or roll to put out flame? Maybe I'm just always swinging my sword at the time when I get set on fire. Hey, you set me on fire. It doesn't set me on fire, okay. Are you about to ignite again? Is that why you're flashing yellowish? Let's see if they do that. It looked like one was trying to. Didn't Navi say something about this? Destroy it before it relights. Yeah, okay, so you're working on doing that? You take forever to do it. Yeah, wow, that's like, how could I possibly not destroy it if I'm putting any effort forward at all? <laughs> Somehow, maybe. Oops. Alright, there's a torch here. Is there a reason for that? Yes, to light the bats on fire. That's what it is. I don't have a compass yet. I'm hoping I'll run into one shortly. Well, that's a simple way to deal with floor tiles. Here, I'm gonna lock... I want to not lock on, I want to just Z-target nothing. But I don't get to do that. If I'm locked on, I can't lock off. This is how I'll deal with you. Long invincibility, got it. Okay. Hey, Spidey. There is a mystery one of you somewhere in this dungeon that I don't understand how to get to. another flame dancer, flare dancer, whatever. Can you be hammered? Yes, okay. Don't need any special crop for that. I missed. Don't think it matters much. Alright, you. You are ridiculously hard to aim for. Like, Link just stabs all around but not where you are. Here, I'm gonna hammer you. Keep doing that. Okay, well, you couldn't keep doing it. Link, could you actually stab the thing instead of, like, everywhere except where it is? You know what? Forget it. I'll just do this. Ah, what an annoying thing to fight. At least, like, the hammer kind of neutralizes this part of the battle, but, like, why does this part have to be? Uh-huh. It's fine. Just takes a while, that's all. Uh, hammer? 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 Hammer. There we go. Okay. It's just the problem is it's always in motion and Link's aiming for where it was when I initiated the sword swing, which is a very long time before the sword swing actually goes off. There's just big delays on everything in this game. Alright, so I came in from I don't know because I don't have a compass. Let's imagine this might be the not the way I came from, correct? Alright, I'm here. That's where I wanted to be. Hi. Am I free? Are you releasing me? Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. Alright, that was your advice. You had none. Fine with me. So, boss key? Other side, maybe?
I'm curious about something. Is this red tunic actually necessary in here? Doesn't immediately seem like it. So in here I am sheltered from the heat of the volcano. Okay, just was curious. I'll change back. Okay, so anyway, I'm here. What rooms haven't I visited? One on 3F, left side, and that's it. But 3F, right side, is where Mystery Spider is. Okay, you're not hammerable. Okay, well I have the boss key, so I could do that whole deal. Let's see. You look hammer responsive. No, that's the thing that I knocked down initially. Got it, okay. Why was it so important to, to do that? I don't know. I just told me to do it. Alright, let's go ahead and fight the boss and I'll come back in here. That doesn't feel right. No, let's not do that. Let's figure out the spider first. So in order to get to 3F west side, I have to go to 3F and there's a little bridge across there. That's how the two connect other than down here. Okay, so up to 3F on the east. And what is with that spider? The problem with this is I have to navigate that awful maze room somehow. I'll try it. No promises it'll uh, go well. <laughs> Alright, so I'm here in the bridge room. How do I ascend? Looks like I go east. Because that one exists in both here and the next floor. You go away. Mm -hmm, that's right. You stay away. Good enough. You leave me alone. Sure, good enough. Okay. Is there a way up here? No. Wait, what? I went north somehow. No, south. Right, I don't know which fa way I'm facing. I don't have a compass. Alright, so to the right. So it was directly across the bridge, after all. Oops, I missed. Well, you know what? Let's just wait in the lava for a bit. It'll be fine. See, it barely hurts. Alright, I think this must be the way. There weren't a lot of other hammerable things on the way here, were there? I don't remember a whole lot of them. How did things work here? I needed to be on this side, and then... something. Uh-huh, I see them. Just kind of roosting there, but they still hurt me on contact. All right, so I put this. In, what link? What? Put this on the spout. Then get on it. My health has been chipped down a bit. I probably could have used those hearts, but I didn't want to make the detour. Alright, what floor am I on now? Two. So find the way up, and I opened a shortcut so it's here. Okay. So this is the best place for figuring out where that spider is, maybe. In theory. The problem is, there's a solid wall I would love to have had the compass. Hold on, so the compass must exist somewhere. Let's see if it's in that little side room on the other side of 3F. And that will help me a whole lot in tracking down the spider. So I need to go whatever must be west. Perhaps using the shape of the room I can infer that this might be west?
So that was indeed west, okay. So keep going west, whichever way you're facing, turn left slightly, then right, and then go that way, okay. Well, that was annoying. Why you gotta be that way? Uh-huh. Okay, well, then it goes away. That's nice. Oh, that doesn't go. Okay, so to get up there, I do what? How do I get up there? Can I... I can't jump from here, surely. No way. Not even close. Well, this is not it. How do I get up there? That's out of reach. Uh-huh. Yes, Firewall, I know. I'm trying to figure something out. How do I get up there? I don't. That's strictly a return path. There is no way there. However, there has to be because... That's the only way to get where I need to be. What? It's inaccessible, though. Video game, what are you doing? I, haven't I been there, though? How did I ever get there in the first place? Like, this is unclimbable. What am I not seeing? Like, I've been there. Does that thing extend? Like this thing? How? Is there a switch somewhere, maybe? It does look like it might, like, extend from the wall or something. Is there such a thing as getting into that room up high? Like, if I... T uh, but now that's all barred off. Okay. Why door is barred? Because I have to shoot that? Okay, sure. Okay, so... If I go through there, does that help me somehow? Link! That doesn't help. Does this le leave me above the fire? Okay, so I can safely pass the fire barrier there. Alright, so from here I can look around and see that, indeed, there's no way over there. So that's strictly a return trip unless that thing extends. Is there a switch in this room somewhere? There's a heart there. I don't see one. So the state of that fire spout elevator reset when I reloaded the game. Like, if there was a switch that affected that once, then that would have reset too, presumably. Which is why I was continuing to go all the way around. Maybe there's a switch on that ledge somehow? Like, I can't just jump to that, right? I can. It does not help me. There are no switches in this room. Is there a similar jump that looks impossible, but just, like, actually works somehow? No way. That's way too far and too high. Okay, I don't understand how to get up there, so I guess I'll just wander randomly around the dungeon until somehow it happens. Okay, so this place where I fell. If I don't go to the heart ledge and stick closer to where this is, maybe I won't fall this time. Yes? No time limit, so just go slowly. Uh huh, uh huh, uh huh. Don't slip off, Link. Just, just do it. So I'm in the cage. That doesn't help me. I could already have gotten down here. There's no switch. I just, there's nothing. There's no way to get up there. What? So this is the spider corner. Wait, I can see. I can see through here. Wait, this is. So my clue is that there are spider noises there? That's a completely unmarked bomb wall. Okay. Weird. Alright, completely unmarked bomb walls exist. I don't think I knew that. I thought they all had at least some some sign of their presence, but alright. Well, that's how to get this thing. 
Still gotta get to that other room where Compass probably is. Whoa, that sounded weird. Okay, uh, so at least that's resolved. Hey, and I got all the spiders, great. So, but that still means I need to cross a, to the west side, which is impossible even though I've done it. How have I done the impossible? Do I need to go back and look at my video and figure that out? Let's try that! Okay, so apparently there's an angle that just works for some reason, even though it really doesn't look like it would. Yes, shut up, I know. So in order to do the impossible... I go here and I jump. Like, yeah, that does not look jumpable. Also, the fire barrier got in my way, so it wasn't. Try again. Alright, fire barrier, you go on but Yeah. Everything. Just nothing is working right now for me. I'm gonna fall in the lava now. No, maybe not. So, here, you go away. Go away. Stay away. I'm doing things. Leave me alone. Okay, so Link's arms are like twice as long as they look, apparently. <laughs> Somehow he's able to clamber up there and that's just the official way to get here? That is so jank! Ugh. Okay, I'm here. Somehow. Ah, why is it such a nightmare? Alright, so I want to go... Northeast from here. Yeah, this room I kind of underexplored. This makes sense. So that's not the way that is. So I never went here. There we go. And this must be compass. Great. Works for me. And I think from that room I was just in, I can take a quick shortcut downwards. There we go. Alright, so all spiders done, nothing to worry about, except for one dragon at the bottom of the dungeon. So the way down is right here. What? Is this still a soft landing, or is that a one-time thing? It's still a soft landing. Okay. How did my health refill? I guess I collected a bunch of hearts. Okay. I'm here now. It's very red. It got redder. That thing goes away. No returning. Wasn't planning on it. Here we go. Subterranean Lava Dragon Volvagia. Does each boss have their own music? No, I've heard this before. It's just there's like a couple of boss tracks, and this is using the alternate one, I guess. Hi. What does Navi have to say? I don't know its weak point. Alright. Is it hammer? Maybe? It didn't seem to like that, and now it's vulnerable. Okay. So it comes out and just kind of flops on the ground for a moment. That's my hammer chance. Okay. I can get you to just kind of coil around me. That's actually not good for me. Okay. I don't know if I can do anything while you're flying around. I suspect not. Hammer. Alright, so now sword. There we go. So one sword hit per hammer hit. Then just wait a long time. Alright. That would appear to be the story. Boulders are falling now. If only I were a child, I could put my shield above me. But I'm just too grown up for that. Hmm, this fight isn't extremely interactive. Yep, just one hit, that's all I get. Not a whole lot of waiting.
tiny little bit of dodging. Right, you wanna just coil around me? Be my guest. Why is it gonna be so bad for the world if this dragon gets out? It doesn't do anything, it just sort of sits there for a while. Oops. Okay, I guess I was too slow. Do I get another chance, or do I have to go through another cycle? Gotta go through another cycle. Alright. Boulder's falling. Okay, just watch for a shadow. They don't even really aim for me much. Like, at all, actually. That one kind of dead. Wow, what is this fight? There's like nothing going on here. Alright, time to play Wacka Dragon. Dragon is still around. Right. Fire breath means you're gonna encircle me. And if I get to just the right spot, then that's actually pretty safe. This fight is silly. Alright, camera, I didn't want you pointing in that direction. If you hold still for long enough, you recenter to the way I'm facing. Four things, I've hammered you, then I'm gonna sword you, and you're dead. Okay. That sure was a fight that just happened. Quite trivial. All twisty. Oh, and then you skeletonized somehow. Yeah. There's your head. Is it still moving? Well, it burned away. Okay. <laughs> and turned into a heart piece. Or sorry, an entire heart. Four pieces. All put together. Okay. Done. Chicken sounds. Volcanoes erupting. <laughs> Controller's shaking violently at this. Oh, and the cloud went away! Well, look at that! The evil has been dispelled. Well, it's been a while since I was here. I'm in a crystal. It's like a reversal of what happens in A Link to the Past. That's where Darunia is. He made it to the Chamber of Sages somehow. This place just sort of exists outside of... Well, yeah, didn't Raru say this is outside of time? Mm-hmm. And outside of space, too. The wild Darunia. Alright. Fire medallion for me. I don't remember what was said about, like, why I'm collecting medallions? Like, the spiritual stones were clear enough. They were the keys to the Temple of Time, and we were keeping them from Ganondorf. Roro might have explained this to me, but I... Whatever he said, the explanation didn't stick with me. Like, the reason to... In, in lore, the reason to deal with these temples is to dispel the evil emanating from them and fix the surrounding area's problems. And awaken the sages... something something. Okay. Well, that's done. Cool. So now... With the cloud dispelled, perhaps Goron City... That's the fire temple again. Perhaps Goron... Wait, is it? Yes. 
Garden City may be lively again. How do I get there from here? This way, I think? The bridge is broken. So maybe I can't go this way around. I have a hammer. Right, and I'm wondering if that perhaps provides a means to deal with... Let's see, can I maybe do this? That worked. Can a hammer deal with those? Huh? Aha! There we go. Alright, so there is a boulder type that's destroyed by hammer. That gets me to business scrubs. Hi. You look so small. Deku nuts. No, I'm good. If one's selling arrows, though, I'll totally buy those. Uh-huh. Yes. 30 pieces. 70 rupees. Let's do it. I'm sure there are free places I could get those, but I need them now, and this is when they're offered. Bombs? Okay. Alright, I did some business. Let's see how Goron City looks. If I can find it... here? Yep. So I can go on a boulder tour of sorts. I couldn't tell what color that was because all the colors were weird in there. That might have been the red-tinged one. I can test it here... Hi, you're back. Alright. This is the shop. I don't need to go there. Although I could talk to the shopkeeper. Let's try. Everybody has come back. Okay, cool. Let's talk to everybody. Hi. Hmm. Not a lot to say, huh? How about you? Not a lot to say, okay. Doesn't seem like there's a lot of conversing to do here. I can make you very grumpy by waking you up and putting you to sleep again. Yes, Navi? What do you have to say nowadays? Okay. Bottom of a lake. That's where she's hinting me to go. I've been there. Briefly. So you want me to go back. I'm trying to find top floor. I'm going to test this hammer on the boulders in there, because there were various... Wow, that pot did not want to break. Boulders of various colors there. And yeah, I need to go on a boulder tour now that I have the boulder dealing with implement. Although maybe not yet. Like some... Okay, so you. Bombable goes down in one. Gray does not go down. Okay, so that's the red-tinged one. So there are some of those in there. These. So the red-tinted ones can be destroyed. The gray ones cannot. I don't think I knew about any red-tinted ones that I needed to deal with yet. Like, it was all gray ones blocking the stuff of interest. But there's this. Huge rupee. Okay. I always get those when I can't carry the whole thing. But yeah, there's just not that much use for money in this game. There's some, but not that much. This is why I'm happy to buy things from business scrubs at whatever prices they want to charge. Okay, so I guess next time boulder tour, because... Okay, do my notes tell me about any red boulders anywhere? Yes, Death Mountain Trail has some. Okay. Yeah, I do have a very specific destination there. I can do that now. That makes sense. So here in the future, weren't these just like all over the place? Yeah, there's a whole bunch here. But I've already seen what's under like this one and it's nothing, right? Does still appear to be nothing. But if I go all the way up here... I think there is at least one of interest. Yeah, so I have a bunch of gray boulders noted, but I think this... Link, why didn't you jump? Link, why don't you jump there? That's just not a jump spot? What does that mean? 
Oh, it's sloped, so it doesn't count as a... Okay, well that's inconvenient. How do I get up here, then? What? The slope's too gentle. This is strange. This... I don't feel like this was a problem before. I can't just climb this. What the heck? Okay, well, I got an alternate way, I guess. Uh. Why does it work to jump as Child Link but not Adult Link? Because there was a boulder there at the bottom? This is very strange. So if I'm in the crater, I can ride the plant and get up top, I think? Maybe? I want to be over there. Okay, so now hang on, those boulders are... I saw some boulders I wanted to break. Ooh, this is something. Yeah, you're the red kind. Can't tell, but you are. A great fairy's fountain. Hey, a great fairy's fountain. Hi. I've only been to one of these before. There's another one in here. <laughs> Same character design. Great Fairy of Wisdom! Alright! Right, and I think this just, like, extends my magic bar? It's like getting half magic, but manifested differently. My magic meter is enhanced! Now I have twice as much. Finally, you say what that means. Okay. Cool, longer magic meter. Not that I was having problems running out, but now I can even less so. Alright, so. Hammer. Hammer. As much as I like the platforming in this game, it just, like, sometimes it just doesn't make sense. Like, that, that slightly too shallow slope on the way here that meant my jump couldn't go off. That's silly. That impossible looking jump in the fire temple, that's silly. But that's just part of the game, just gotta deal with it. Alright, so now I'm up here. There's the other great fairy's fountain there. There are two on this mountain. Alright, so you're the kind of spider that wants to just knock me off. Well, I'm jumping. That's fine. This boulder, right here! One of these had a Skeltula inside it that I already dealt with. Doesn't one have something more interesting? No. Okay, I misremembered. I thought there was something there. Huh, I really thought there was something there. I thought it was the thing that is being pointed at here. Maybe it is and it's just not in a spot I expect? This is the cow hole. Can I do anything in here? Is there a boulder? Cow, beehive... no, there's like nothing here. Okay, I remembered wrong, I guess. Oh, that time you jump. So it can happen, it just doesn't tend to. What's the nuance? Like, he goes down slightly before he does it. Was my angle just not quite... Then you did a little tiny jump down. So if my angle's not quite straight on, you just fall. So it has to be a very, very straight angle. Okay, I guess that's the nuance. Ooh, so Hammer can flip the Tektite over. That's interesting. I'm smashing all the boulders on this trail just in case it does something. I don't suspect it will. So one last thing I'm wondering, now that I have resolved the cloud over Death Mountain, I'm wondering if maybe Big Goron will take my broken sword when he wouldn't before? I don't know why that would be the trigger, but maybe? 
All right, you, the big one. Are you interested in the snow? It looks like this item doesn't work here. I don't understand why. Like, this is obviously what I do, but, but it's not somehow. Maybe if I talk to that gossip stone, it'll give me a hint? Okay. So, so item just, just can't be used here. Someone else needs to deal with the... Well, it doesn't say big Goron sword, it just says Goron sword. There's some reclusive Goron somewhere who's gonna do something with this? I would think it'd be you, you're the weaponsmith, but you're the one who makes, like, low durability weapons. Well, yeah, this one's broken. Okay, I don't get it. Like, my map points me to somewhere on Death Mountain, but... But where? This is bothering me. I'm gonna persist for a bit. So Link at least has something unique to say. He didn't do much, he was just kind of there in the Chamber of Sages. But not much needed to be done. Okay. Oh! Okay, so there are rupees down there, but if I fall in the lava, I just... Just have to respawn, okay. So this is a spot for Pierre to come out. I don't know if I ever bothered going this far down in the crater. Is there a point to this beyond those that little handful of rupees? I guess there's another spot for you there. And that's the more official way to get over there? Maybe. Is that close enough? No. Yeah, this doesn't get me there. And it looks like it's just for a tiny little bit of money, but maybe like Stone of Agony would trigger in that spot and there'd be a secret or something? Anyway, what I'm looking for is not here. Whoops. What the? Uh, hello? Hello? There's something back there. That's what I'm looking for, isn't it? Okay, you're pointing at a Tektite there. Wait, I see something. Like, I am seeing a thing of interest here. I was kind of right about the general location. But I need to find something or other... Over that ridge is something of interest. How do I access it, though? So that Goron in the mountain is kind of big, but there's a bigger one there. How do I get over there? There's a really big Goron there. Is there a side path that goes there? Do I have to be up at the top? Like, the flying plant doesn't go in that direction, but yeah, there's clearly a really, really big Goron up there. Hmm. No, oh, I just had to sort of go vaguely over in that direction. Okay. Well, I found you. Sleepy boy. Hi. Not that sleepy, your eyes are... Metagoron's Blade Store. Okay. All right, so you're the one. Alien Carpenters, yes. Yeah, check it out, I got a thing here. Mm-hmm. Yesterday's eruption. Okay, so you just became available to me because I cleared the cloud. This is what this did, I see. All right, Zora's Domain, Eye Drops, King Zora, got it. Sure. Prescription. Okay, so that'll be next time. Gonna be sent on a whole adventure there. Good stuff, so that's how this works. <laughs> okay. I'm working on it. Yeah, you're gonna have tears in your eyes for a couple more days. But I'll, I'll fix you up soon. All right, I'll see you next time to do that.